Hello beautiful Gemini, my name is Trudy and I'm your Portrait Gypsy Angel Medium. This is your April 2020 reading. This is for Gemini Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Vedic, uh, Vedic Sidereal, Western Astrology, and Cross Watchers. Hi. So my name is Trudy and I'm a report to Gypsy Angel Medium. This month we're going to be using the Angel Tarot by Dorian Virtue and Rally Valentine. So psh, 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 thank you to those of you. This is Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. This is the most important messages for Gemini. Thank you, thank you, thank you, angels. Um, I wanted to say thank you to those of you who like, share, subscribe, and comment on the channel because it helps the growth. It also suggests the message to somebody else, a fellow Gemini who might need to hear the message. So please do take a moment to like and subscribe. Hit that red subscribe button and activate 10 years of good luck. So, Gemini, what story have you got for me? Also, if you want a private exchange of energies with me, click on the description box below. Follow those instructions and we will make that happen. So, I'm hearing we still got two more cards. That's one. Okay. Let's Yes, thank you. All right, so Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Wow, I want to be a Gemini today. Talking about falling in love again. Yes, you're falling in love. There is, or perhaps it could be like a reconciliation of a relationship, the deepening of an existing relationship. Like, let's say you're already in a relationship, however, it took on a whole nother level. Like, you guys maybe moved in together, or maybe they put a ring on it, or maybe you're actually setting a date to get married, or you're actually getting married. I don't know, something, something big is changing in the relationship if it exists. If it doesn't exist and it's brand new, it's like from a past life. There's a huge connection, and it adds to your spiritual growth. Um, so your intuition, blah, 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 blah. your intuition, Gemini, in the month of April is incredibly heightened. Um, there's also good news concerning a new business, uh, venture that you may be embarking on. Um, so like good, good news concerning money coming back to you, money that you had invested a while ago. Um, and use your originality, use that ingenuity that only you have, Gemini, because you're, you're an original, often imitated, but never duplicated because you are the duplicate yourself, the Gemini. Oh yeah. I love it. Anyways. So, um, right. Eight of air. So this is you feeling kind of like you're stuck, you're stagnant, like you can't move, but this is an illusion. It's mental entrapment. It's not real. The illusion is that you're trapped, but it's mental. So you're the one setting the limits. What if I was to tell you that the sky is the limit? And then suddenly I mentioned to you the cosmic realm, which is beyond the skies. And suddenly you see that the sky is actually like me setting a boundary that doesn't need to be there. So get uh, Gemini, let's let's use this out of the uh, as an example. This is you, this beautiful crystal right here and get out of your own way. OK, message received, I hope <laughs> so. I'm going to move on to the, because I separate this deck into two. So that was the guardian angel messages. Now this is the archangel messages. So psh, psh, psh. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Cross Watcher. Thank you so much. Yes, that was quick. Archangel Ariel and Archangel Haniel. I love this. Okay, so Archangel Ariel is here talking about using your inner strength to gosh Gemini you've been exposed to a lot of harsh judgment you know people like blame you they use you as their scapegoat all of the time and so you've got a really bad rep 
and if people judge you then you know what you need to look at them like they are incompetent pray for them pray for their enlightenment pray for their forgiveness and give them your compassion <laughs>